Uh, Elden Ring's just been fantastic. And uh, I've been having a fantastic time with this game. I'm loving it. Uh, let's see. We are, I guess it says we are Chad Dickerson. Is about we're about 20 ish 22 hours in a little less than 22 hours uh let's do it yep let's go uh jates thank you so much for the 10 months thank you jates i appreciate that thank you so much i am bowl man and do not make fun of the size of my weapon do not make fun of the size of my weapon do you play offline you know actually i speak i actually would prefer i i think i like as much as I enjoy playing offline because I don't want it, I feel like I lose more because I like reading people's messages and stuff. I actually do. You might get spoiled here and there, I guess. I kind of actually want to play online again. Uh, let's see. Play. We're going to play online, I think. I actually do like playing online. We just have to hit login, I guess. I actually do. They can be pretty funny. They can be amusing. I, I think I'd rather play online. Yeah, the messages are funny, you know, I don't know. Well, whatever, who cares? Uh, Handsome Navigator, thank you for the 14 months. Thank you, Handsome Navigator. What happened to the Wolverine Claws? Nothing happened to the Wolverine Claws. I still have them. I kind of have three different weapons I'm using. I've got Black Knife plus six. I've got the Flail plus eight. And I have the, uh, the Hook Claws plus eight. So I really, I have, uh, I have number of different weapons number of different weapons yeah I, I agree crimson i like seeing people's messages around i like it oh so we just went to the dragon island we just went here and we found something oh you know by the way by the way guys uh sylphid thank you for the 10 months thank you sylphid remember yesterday when i was like did i just see an invisible fucking tower i went back and watched the clip I absolutely did see an invisible tower. So there's some kind of moving invisible tower. That actually I that actually was real. I was not insane. There actually is a moving tower somewhere and I just random across it and right as it disappeared. We saw it and then it just disappeared right from there. I I don't know what it is. I don't know where it is. I think it was like somewhere around this area. I feel like it probably has something to do about with time of day. I feel like it has something to do with time of day is my guess. So, uh, let's see. Mimics veil. Let me look at my items here real quick. Is there key items here? I want to see something. Great rune of the unborn. Used to... to uh, amber egg clutched by Renala per, uh, perfects those who are born anew. So this is the thing that allows me to uh, respec, I guess. That allows me to respec. I kind of wanted to look at my shit here for a second. Offer to twin maiden husks for new item access? Twin? What is twin maiden husks? Something I think I need to do more of is reading item descriptions. I think I need to do that more. Oh, great. Barb is starting to lose it. <laughs> Let me uh, go around. So these, this is how you get boss weapons and boss items. That we know. Here we go again. Let's see. This is our blacksmith friend. This is our hog lady. Oh, it's a big fees. How's it going? Yeah, we got a big we got a big bowl hat. I'm looking for some fruit to put in there. Can't open this door. There's a path this way. I don't remember what we found in here. I don't remember what it was. It was like a book or something. Yeah. Nacho Sombrero. See, shouldn't there be uh do I do I have to log back in to be playing online? I was like, shouldn't there be a messages everywhere? Strike. I think I maybe need to log back in to be playing online. Uh Winter Melon, thank you for Yeah, I think I need to reload. Subscription. Is this a door? No. Uh, Sir Thickalus, thank you for 11 months. Thank you, Sir Thickalus. Appreciate that. Okay, so it's not in here. So I think that this item I have with the twin maiden thing, 
This is the fingers. What do you have to say? Oh, no, we are playing online. <laughs> no, we're fine. I'm off in search of a noble scholar known as the gold mask. We may not meet again if there's any incantation. Oh, he's got some magic. Urgent heal. Rejection. These are these are all miracles he's teaching. Interesting. Heal HP for self alleviates poison. Increases fire damage. Throw balls of raging fire. Flame sling. Let's grab the heal. Why not? I'll take your heal. Uh, Dark Jester. Thank you so much for the gift sub. I appreciate that. Thank you, Dark Jester. Oh, look. Somebody parkoured their way up there. What do you have to say? You've received the wisdom of the two fingers, have you not? Then I bid you welcome. I am known as Gideon Ofnir. As a tarnished who wishes to stand, I am a cumul. You now belong to a select group of fellow. Okay, do you have anything else to say? More great runes now. Then as your fellow, allow the inheritors of the great runes, the shard bearers. We of the round table know the location of five of them. Godric the Grafted, Lord of Storm. Killed him. General Radan. Who fought Melania and her rot to a standstill in the Kaelin Wilds. Oh no, I haven't found Major him. Rikard, Lord of the Volcano Manor of Mount Gelmir. Haven't found him. Got the grace given. Veiled monarch and Lord of Lane Dell. And Renala. We killed her. That one we killed. Ruler of Ray. You'll still be after more great Ray. Okay, so they'll tell you I uh, maybe this is how you find these. He can like, oh, I'm looking for this person. They'll like give you a hint or something. Visions of friend, ah, friend. Could this be a fire? Could could it? <laughs> okay, interesting. You again? I thought you'd receive a summons to the round table. Ah, uh, Sadie, the thank you so much for the seven months. Glad to see you here. I found it in Godric's grave. You defeated him. Make good use of it. I don't intend to make a hack. subscription. Arsenal charm. Ah, oh, yes. I wonder if you've... he's in his study. If you haven't already, father is lead. I'm sure talking to. So we got a new charm from talking to her. What's this charm we just got? Oh, Arsenal Charm. You know, what's funny is that we actually have Arsenal Charm plus one. So we actually have a better version of that. Ooh. Oh, hey, check it out. Offered the bell. Bro, look at all the weapons and shit they have here. Grants the blessing. When invaded, request the aid of a hunter. Cracked crystal. Reinforce a special armament to plus three. So we have found some somber. Dude, she's got three keys here. She's got some keys. Dagger, longsword, rapier, scimitar. Okay, so overall, not great stuff. But, uh, okay. Cool. And a spell slot for 3,000. A spell slot. See a spell slot here? I don't see a spell slot at all. Keys are good. Yeah, keys are good. The stone sword keys are very good. Uh, Rose Guard, thank you so much for the 16 months. Thank you very much. Oh, that's... Oh, you're right. That is what the memory stone is. So this could... You can increase your uh, your casting with that. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Have you ever felt the curse? With your whole being. Dude, this guy's got pimples all over him. Apparently not. You are but a lamb. You no longer interest me. I've been long without thee. Was this the guy well, we defeated? Thankful of that. It is all the... Have I beaten the game? No, no, I haven't beaten the game. Is that the guy he like, he invaded here and he attacked and shit? I think that was him, right? No, we haven't beat the game yet. Um, I would also say like... I would say I'm like taking my time and doing stuff and like, you know, I'm not trying to rush through it, but I also like, I honestly am not super sure where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> I'm also not like 100% sure like where I'm supposed to go and shit. So, okay. So I think we're going to head back and go somewhere else now. Uh, in terms of where we go. Uh, let's go to the War Master Shack. I haven't been back there in a while. It's a big game. Yeah, it's a big, big game. You here for the flail dangle? Uh, Brennan, thank you for the 20 months. How am I enjoying this game? I'm really, really enjoying this game. There you are. 
So this guy sells these. Grants affinities and skills to, uh, let's see, Quick Step, Storm Blade, uh, Parry, Spinning Slash, War Cry. So we can buy these various moves. Interesting. Let's buy the Spinning Slash. Why not? We'll buy that. Maybe we can use that on something. All right, let's head, uh, let's head east. Did the mini patch fix your, stu your stuttering? I mean, we only just started for today, so I, I haven't, I haven't really noticed any, uh, stuttering just yet. Yeah, I'm, I'm basically Cuphead, right? Pretty much. What's up, Athena? How was my evening? Uh, I kind of, kind of passed out. And I was like, oh. Passed out pretty hard, as you can imagine. I was in a major, major brain fog. I was like so tired yesterday. <laughs> I was super, super tired. Did I sleep well? I slept well until the cats interfered. Suck on that, motherfucker. <laughs> Can you drink out of my cup? It'd be cool if I could. I think there was an item up top, too. Nice for to be real good. I don't know how Zeus is still lucid. He's like barely lucid, though. <laughs> I told I told Hey, hey Zeus has been streaming for 24 hours straight. Uh, it wasn't, I don't think it was a planned 24 hour stream. It just kind of like an accidental one. I totally understand that, but I told him I wanted to tuck him into bed. And that's honestly, I wanted to, I really do. I want to take a little blanket and like pull it up to his chin and be like, okay, good night. <laughs> I want to tuck him in. Ooh, what we got here? Unthinkable. Our how left resting place is violated. To refuse the Urtree's call to return to live within death. Sickening. We got in here. Does the beard go above or below the blanket? I think above. It's got to be above. Can you get other mounts in this game? Uh, not to my knowledge. Not yet. Not to my knowledge. The beard is the blanket. I'll eat cereal out of your cup. Oh, let me turn on the old lantern here. You know, chat, if you're watching, all I have to say to, all I have to, say to you is this. You're beautiful. <laughs> oh, skelly men. My favorite. You should use the hello rune. I'm not even sure if I have that. Be wary of Archer. Thank you, game. Hidden path ahead. This entire fucking game just lies to you constantly about hidden paths. <laughs> it constantly lies. The online play is just a fuck. It's just constant, literal constant lies. <laughs> hidden path. Hidden path. Oh, there, there's the archer finally. Well, there obviously is a way up top here, right? So maybe there really is a hidden path. Maybe maybe it's not a lie. Be wary of behind. Uh, 
Ow. Hidden path ahead. You know what? Go to hell, game. <laughs> Go to hell. Oh, hidden path. Kick Leo. Uh, there is definitely some other way to go here, though. There's definitely another way. Man, where did all... I thought I killed all of the skeletons. Where did all these more skeletons come from? Oh, here's a little sneaky tunnel. A little sneaky tunnel here. Uh, here, let's go do uh, Bestial Vitality. Let's go heal myself up a little bit. Secret passage ahead. Go to hell. This fucking game is so stupid. Did you guys already see that uh, the the debate the debate has started again over whether or not it was like it only takes one fucking Twitter to be like, oh this oh, this game is so stupid. Why is it so hard? This game should have an easy mode. Well, I was enjoying this game. Whoa, Uchi Gatana. Whoa. It only takes one Twitter account to be like, oh, game is too hard. Game is too hard. This is bullshit. I'm leaving. It's hard. The debate has already started again. I already started again. Scripture wooden shield. No weapon durability. Time for weeb. You love the salty bads. Honestly, I feel like I, I, I this is how I kind of feel in the past. I've, I've like laughed at those people. I think the thing is, is at this point, I kind of feel like, you know what? Just give it to them. Just give them the way they want to make every enemy have one HP. If they want to ruin the game for themselves, give it, just give it to them. I'm sure that modders will do it anyway before too long. I of the opinion. Just give it to them to shut them up. Uh, so let's see. We got the Uchi Katana. Uh, Katana with a long single edge blade. The blade with its undulating design. Sheath blade. Follow up with a normal or strong attack. The unsheath. Yeah, if they want, if they want it, give it to them. They want to ruin the game for themselves. What do I care? All right. This boss. Uh, we'll see how this boss goes. Let's go. Another one of these god. I have fought like four of these black knife assassins at this point. I don't think this guy's gonna survive much longer. Ow. Hey. He isn't even at full health. Yeah, he's not. Assassin's Crimson Dagger. Is that a is that a weapon? So I think this is an area you're meant to find at a much, a much lower level than I'm currently at. We found some more death root. Double dagger. I don't know if that was a weapon though. Yeah, it's not a weapon. I'm not sure what that was. Which boss has been my favorite so far? The moon sorceress lady was really cool. Um, that fight was very, very cool, I think. So, was it a rune or something? Ah, oh, here we go. Critical hits restore HP. That's kind of cool. Um, I, I guess a critical hit is when you stagger an enemy. Like, that's considered... What does it say? Seems familiar, so speak visions of chaos. Behold, material. Secret path ahead. Could this be an item? But why is it always fire? Uh, my favorite boss has been Worm Face. <laughs> it, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm in agreement. At this point, I'm like, if, I, this is my opinion. If people want to play the game and make everything one hit, one HP, and they want to have like 10 million HP so they can never die, if that's the way what they want, I say give it to them. That way we never have to revisit this debate again. I mean, honestly, that's not, we're not talking about something really hard to code, you know? What did worm face look like? So he was a big fucking guy and he had a face full of worms. 
It was a huge giant and his face was worms. That's my take. At, at least in part, I never have to listen to it, so I won't have to listen to it ever again. Uh, what's up, Natoms? What's the challenge on doing that? I mean, I still think that I still think that should be obviously like a normal mode, like I think there's nothing wrong with doing what I, what I'm saying. All they're doing is is cheapening the experience for themselves. But if that's how they want to have fun, let them have fun. Yeah, let them have it. Let them have it. It's not going to bother me because I still enjoy the game. I obviously like the challenge. So you're starting to miss Wolverine. Dude, I still have the claws. I just, uh, I, it, so the bleed is only good against stuff that actually bleeds and skeletons don't bleed. So I still got it here. Yeah, yeah. If they want to, if they want to play the, I mean, in the end, modders are going to do that shit anyway, so. Uh, speaking of shit that doesn't bleed. Dagger, 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 dagger. Where's my dagger? Actually, where's my flail? Where's my flail? I can't see shit. Easy game for babies. Uh, J guy, thank you for the 22 months. Thank you, J guy. I'm OP. I wouldn't say I'm OP. This is just like an earlier area. Uh, I wouldn't really say I'm OP. I'm just kind of in an earlier area. I'm playing on PC. The helmet is OP. How do I get uh, up this? Hang on. Bit of a jaw jammer. Fashion is so nuanced. I might start wearing a candy dish on your head. <laughs> So we, uh, we just did this cave, we just did that. I wish I could put some fruit on my head, put like a banana, some apples. The updates improved the game. Apparently yeah, people were saying that there was some kind of update. I, I didn't see the update yet. All right, let's head this way. I have both apples and bananas. It was for collecting rainwater. Get out of here. Get fucking Shrek, buddy. How do you... So this gigantic bridge thing, is there a way on top of this fucking gigantic bridge? Yeah, it's like somewhere from here and maybe you can cross from there. So do you have to like go into the castle or something? The challenge isn't hard enough. You can still wear a head over a long time, which makes you take more damage. Is that is that an item in the game? <laughs> is that an item? It, it wouldn't, at this point, I don't think I'd be surprised. Or are you talking about the uh, the beetle head, my bug helmet? Yeah, dude, I was wearing a uh, I was wearing this this helmet. Here, I'll show you the helmet. This uh, glintstone scarab. I was wearing this for a while. It makes you take more damage. <laughs> it literally makes you take li more damage. I got excited anytime I see something purple and shiny on the ground. 
Why is there a helmet for taking more damage? There's a, there's a ring in Dark Souls that makes everything do more damage to you. you know, there's, a, there's all kinds of stuff. It looks so awesome. I don't know, dude. I kind of like my bowl hat. Bowl hat is the height of fashion. Okay, a little choppy here. Fucking, did you kill my horse? This fucking nerd killed my horse. Okay. What's my favorite area I found so far? Mm, the underground area, like the giant cave area, is so cool. Those archers, man. So this. Oh my god, I just got fucking ballista in the face. Those, uh, the archers that are there that are like mega snipers. Those guys are gigantic douchebags. Okay, I am kind of, I'm kind of mashing attack and it's punishing me. I'm gonna get backstabbed by my flail. Have I found ways to farm smith stones? No, no, I haven't. In fact, I've like actively wasted smith stones because I ke I've upgraded three different weapons. <laughs> I've upgraded three different weapons. So this is where we fight. Uh, this is where we fought uh, Margit. Uh, we actually caught up with Margit again and killed him. So Margit is fully dead. But like that wall, is there a way to get that way? We've been we've obviously been through this entire castle before. There's gotta be a way to like open this gate, right? <sighs> hmm. Margit got got, exactly. Is there an item down there? What's down here? I want to see. So yeah, we're just going to be looking around, exploring, and seeing what we can find today. Uh, there's something over here. Did you ever, go, you ever do that thing for that witch? Uh, I don't remember what she wanted me to do. I just actually don't remember. It was like, go to Mistvale Woods or something. I'm not even sure. Something like that. Huh. Okay. That just takes me back outside. That seems odd. Is there a path over here, too? There's a path over here, too. Check it out. Furl calling finger remedy. Why do some bonfires have a yellow trail? Uh, I guess that's like the thing is supposed to be guiding you or something or other. Okay. Uh, hang on a second, guys. Uh, I have to get up. I have to use the bathroom. I'll be back in a second. Hang on. We're going to close this out. Uh, you know what? You know what I'm blaming? You know what I'm blaming? Coffee. I'm blaming coffee. Okay, we're back here. Thank you. Uh, all right, so we were looking around. We're just kind of exploring and looking around and trying to figure shit out as we go. Fucking bird. 
Ah, uh, what's up, dude? How's it going? What's up, y'all beaches? The old drinky. Uh, there's an item here we never got. Some bolts. Something else over there. There's so many like little nooks and crannies here. There's so many nooks and crannies. What have you found out in order to progress towards the end? Uh, did I be real with you? We got to this gigantic upper area, right? This like area, divine bridge, erd tree, phantom, all this gigantic area. And I looked around there a lot. And I did some stuff, but now I am massively sidetracked and now I'm just, uh, <laughs> it's in like, are you, are you just going to play the game? Are you going to play this game and you're going to make a literal beeline for the ending? Or are you going to like, look around, explore, enjoy? Like, are you just going to go like a beeline just for the end? Like, come on, you got to explore. You got to look around. You're going to find bosses, upgrades, like you name it. We're not taking a beeline for the for the end. We're not doing that. Besides, if I'm totally honest, I, I, I'm not even sure I know how to get to whatever the ending may be. Uh, I don't know if I ever went. So like, that's the area we we're looking at, but I don't think we know how to get there either. I don't think we know how to get there. Sniper ahead. So this was an area where you had to get the key to go up here, if I remember right. Uh, what's the end game here? Uh, we're trying to defeat all the lords and become the Elden, all, the Elden Lord ourselves, right? Or whatever. I'm like that. Who knows? Can I? Can I even fast travel from here? I'm gonna die to this like beginner guy. Good lord! You know, did he need a. How is this guy even here? You came all the way in here for this? How did you even make it all the way in here? Asshole. Huh? Hmm. Can I even can I travel? Cannot travel to a site from this location, so I can't travel from here. Okay. So with the flail, uh I've got other weapons. I've also got the Wolverine claws, which I like a lot. Wolverine claws are fun. This game is a gigantic maze. <laughs> this game is a gigantic maze. Even this castle is so big. I was trying to find my way back to like the beginning of the castle because I feel like there was a giant path connected here oh, that like took me somewhere, but I don't know where. Yeah, I've got the uh, these Wolverine claws. Hey, screw you. Oh, uh, what's up, Pudlix? How are you? Do you take a poop or leave a poop? Did we ever find the uh, lever for this? Did we? I think we did, didn't we? Technically speaking, you leave a poop, but that's not really... How did I never find this elevator? I've, like, cleared this entire castle. I think technically you leave a poop, do you not? I've been all through this castle. I never even found this fucking elevator.
How do I even get over there? You drop a deuce. Maybe you drop. Huh? One does leave poop. Okay. Golden rune. Ah, uh, 1080p. Thank you for 16 months. Thank you, 1080p. Appreciate it. Let's go ahead and cast this. Your character kind of looks like a jester. Yeah, my character's all kinds of fucked up, man. He's a mess. Is that all there is here? Is that it? Oh! Oh! What is this shit? Secret past your head, therefore, right. So there's I this is bullshit. There's item here and there's items there and there's like a whole other path. Bro, which way do I go? Do I go left or right, chat? I don't know. Do I go left or right? <laughs> I want that item, but I want that too. And I, I don't know. Right? Right? Pick the right one. Always right. All right. Chat says right. Smithing stone. Oh, oh. Okay, so going actually going right was better. It was going be well, going right was better. Raptor ahead. Uh, he was right about that. Dozing cross legged. Okay. I'm betting they connect. Okay, what does this say? Joy ahead. Strong foe head, therefore dashing through required ahead. Oh, these guys? Hmm, man. Do you see why it's really easy to get lost in this fucking game? Do you see why? <laughs> Why it's just like so easy to just get completely lost and like, what am I doing? I guess I'm doing everything. Okay. You were no match for fucking Wolverine, bitch. World is huge. Like, it's not just that it's like a, like a big thing. Like, people ask, like, how big is the world? How big? How big, right? It's that this area, I've been through this area, I beat the boss here, but there's still, like, so much here I didn't even see, apparently. Like, I missed a lot. So it's like, you don't just go over an area once and you're done. Like, you're not going to find everything on one go through. So it's going to take multiple times it's yeah it's like the density right there's like all these items and paths there's probably i think i saw on a couple streams i've been watching a little bit of elden ring i've seen a couple of npcs i've never seen before so there's like magic sellers and stuff oh here we go Secret ahead, you fucking liar. <laughs> oh, secret right here, Barb. Check it out. Got him. Banished Knight Greatsword. That's cool. Like, 
Roll, 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 and you still get hit by it. Get out of here. Okay, a little, a little chop and slow down right there. A little choppy. It's a balder night. Festering bloody finger. Is there goals on the map? Uh, here's your map. Place beacon, close, marker, sites of grace, show multiplayer status. Uh, what is multiplayer status anyway? Is that like co-op and invasion sites? Is that what that is? I don't remember where I found the claws. I do not remember. I actually found two pairs of claws. I have another kind. Um, hang on. Here's here's the other claws, the raptor talons. These are the other claws I found. <laughs> I actually have two. Uh, I'm only. I mean, I this one actually. Uh, I'm not sure which one's like technically better, but uh, I, I these have been upgraded already. Oh, what the fuck is this? How do you get in here? I don't even, I literally don't even know how you get in here. Even if I had a stone shard key, I don't even know, dude. Time for ambush. Time for revenge. Okay, so we're actually finally on the other side of the main gate. Can I open the main gate? Can I go do that? Dude, all these smithing stones we're finding are also really good. No, there's a lot of keys I could theoretically buy. That, this thing, this fog gate here, it didn't even have uh, a key slot. It didn't even have one. So, I, I, uh. Try giant butthole. Okay, so we're on the other side of the main gate. Oh, shit. Okay. Open the gate! Open the gate a little! Cool. So we hadn't done that before. Cool. Do I have a group code? I don't know what that is. We got commoner simple garb likely pathetic sort yeah it probably is <laughs> there's a bunch of items down there too you know everybody everybody i've seen playing the game is using like big axe big hammer big sword I'm fucking Wolverine, bitches. Gold, uh, gold rune, gold rune. Okay, so this is back towards the start. Big, yeah, I, I like, uh, dude, where the fuck did Pooh find a goddamn anchor? Where the hell did he even get that? I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. The weapon's sick, though. A uh, little choppy here and there today. You have the anchor. I don't know where. I don't know where he got it. I don't know where he got it. It's cool though. I'm je I'm jelly. If I had found the boat anchor, I'd probably use it too. Somebody tape a, a, a sword to a lion? Somber smithing stone, beast blood, old fang. Okay. 
What is beast blood? The hell is beast blood? I don't know. It's like a crafting material, is that what it is? Kind of item crafting here. Warming stone crafting material. Yeah, probably, right? Hmm, okay. What's well, over here? Light? Dark Souls 4. I saw a tweet that said this game is like Dark Souls 4, 5, and 6 combined, and I, I think it kind of is. <laughs> it, it really kind of is. So this is an air... Oh, dude, we're on this tower thing. I haven't... Oh, so I have no idea. We're on the right area. This is kind of what I was looking for. I wanted to go over there because I hadn't figured it out. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. I don't know what's over there. I want to see what's over here. How many souls do I have? 14,000. Bolt Drake Talisman. Is it like a lightning boost? Lightning damage negation. Okay. Your souls in this game are uh, runes. Okay, well, this is absolutely a fucking boss fight. <laughs> All right, where is it? Not a boss fight? Okay, so I can't summon my owl. I can't summon my horse. Holy shit. There's, there's a lot of these fucking guys. Oh my god, dude. Excuse me. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Goodness. <sighs> Warming stone. Have you summoned the necroheads with the flail? It requires uh, 15 intelligence to do that. I, I don't have the intelligence yet. Yeah, travel me. Where the fuck is this taking me? Haha, ha, dumb. Yeah, I'm not intelligent enough, unfortunately. Sorry. Those flail, that, that flail actually does seem like a pretty good weapon, though. Okay, so now we're way over here. Um, what, dude, this, what if this is one of the, the big bosses we have to fight? What if this is one of the big ones, man? Hmm. Let's go backwards first. Cleric beast vibes. We're going to go backwards before going forward. Uh, Zastra, thanks so much for the 25 months out. Boy, f flying enemies sure are fun. God damn it, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. I knew there was going to be something here. Item ahead. Hmm. Do it. <laughs> what is it? Twitch chat there? Still can't summon. All right. Let's go in here. Is this going to be a big fucking tower or what is this going to be? 
Uh, rainy days. Thank you so much for the four months. Thank you, rainy days. Let's see what this is going to be. Oh, we missed an item right here. Another golden rune. Okay. If I can't open this door, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> I'm going to tell you now, I'm going to be pissed. Is this the giant tree over there? Uh, yeah, that's the giant tree. Divine Tower of Limgrave. It's locked from the other side, yeah. Seek Tower. Praise the Elden Ring. Why is it always meshes, but still no hidden path? No hiding place ahead. <laughs> These fucking online messages. Dastard ahead. Dastard? Oh, uh, okay. Find another one of these. Let's go ahead and uh, rest. Why are you dripping urine? What the fuck? Restore the power of the great rune. Great rune restored Godric's great rune. So. Uh, not listed here. Is it a key item? Raises all attributes. So because so we killed Godric, we got his rune, but his rune lost all of his power. If we have this, it raises all of our attributes, but you have to use it, right? I'm not sure how the great rune stuff works. I'm not sure how it works. Grants the blessing of an equipped rune. So we've got the rune arc. Rune arc. Can I put that on my equip slot here? Let's just try it. I want to see what it does. Okay, so we've got the rune arc. So did I just raise all my attributes? Like permanently or, or I, I don't understand how it works. I don't understand how it works. Honest, I'm going to be honest with you. I have no idea. So that seemed like something really important, though. Like that seemed like we needed to do this. Liar ahead. Okay. Use it as at a. Oh, maybe use it at a grace. Uh, maybe. Yeah. I really thought there was going to be like a boss fight up here or something. Honestly, I thought we we're going to fight on top of this tower. Why is it? Why is Bar wearing a fruit bowl on his head? Did you ever want fruit, but you don't have any nearby? I don't have that problem. Oh, great runes. You can equip great runes that have had power. You can use a rune art to give greater benefit to your equipped runes. Okay, so we can just equip. So this is like another ring slot or something. You change the equipped great rune, the current great runes effect will be, I don't have any runes. So we just, okay, so doing that just raised my attributes. Uh, I can't tell, I can't tell a difference, but I guess that's good. 
So we just equipped Godric's Great Rune, and I think that made us a lot stronger, I guess. Okay. Cool. Okay. Maybe we're a lot stronger now? I don't know. Maybe we're stronger? I'll leave it to chance. Did my PC crash? No, my PC, that's the weird part, is that my PC didn't crash. It was like a, it was like some kind of encoder error on OBS or something. And my monitor was re repeatedly flashing black. Uh, very strange. Yeah, I do have the great rune equipped. It was very weird. Very, very strange. I don't, I don't know what happened there. Everything seems fine now. Uh, Master of Ninja. Thank you for the three months. Thank you, Master of Ninja. Yeah, sorry, guys. Ow. Ow. Well. Okay, now let's... Now do we try a rune arc here? You know, if these enemies would give me one fucking second... Holy fucking shit. Even the fucking nerds are stuck. They have wind powers too. No, I didn't lose any progress. Look at this. Hmm? Some kind of temporary stat boost of some kind. Yeah. How many guys are there here? Oh, it's definitely cool. Yeah, it's just a question of like, what does it actually do? I got quite a bit of health and stamina from that. So I, I didn't get it until I used the thing, I guess. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, I think maybe we were here before. Uh, Aoto, thank you for the 34 months. I think maybe, we, yeah, okay, we were here earlier and we went backwards through this area, if, I'm, if I remember right. <laughs> Man, if you go the front way through this, this is like actually horrible. <laughs> you go the front way, if you somehow manage to go the front way, it's awful. Cross over the threshold of one million bread. Wooden great shield. Yeah. How long it take for the first no hit runs of this game? Well, it's I think it's a question of finding of like learn like figuring out the min max of the game. Like that's kind of what no hit runners do a lot of the time is they figure out how to how, how do you min max your damage and what's the fastest way to do the most damage and then from there it's just learning boss move sets and the fastest way towards the end oh my god the claws are pretty cool We already found this. Pretty sure we fought these guys too. Is it still frozen or is it just you? I think it's just you. This is where God the Godric was, right? This is where Godric was or something. Godwin, Godric. Yeah, this was the boss fight. Okay, uh... And then this is like... Past this... Is like, you're just out of here. There's still this, like, path to the west here. Um... Can we... Let's go here? Yeah, I, I, I'm sorry. I had to restart, um, OBS. I had, a, I had a computer error. I'm sorry. There's nothing I could do. Um, I, I'm aware I lost viewers. It's always delightful to 
have non-stop technical issues. I think it was actually the game, though. I think the game caused some kind of glitch. It caused it. I don't. I don't need to be reminded. Nobody gets more pissed off at technical errors than me. Trust me. Uh, Grant G, thank you for the seven months. Thank you. Okay, this is getting fucking choppy as shit all of a sudden. Oh, mega choppy. You see that? Is that how you get over there to this tower? Like, how do you think you get to this tower? You think maybe there's like a cave nearby somewhere? Maybe a teleporter? Yeah, maybe. Let's go down. At least try to. It's probably a graphics, cr uh, graphics driver crash. Yeah, maybe. Reporting for duty. Uh... Barb and Aloy have a lot in common. Oh, is that the thing that prevents you from healing? It is. You can't use your, uh, you can't use your Estus. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know those were in this game. I hadn't seen one yet. Yep. You know, we, 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 you know, we're both driven. We both are, have strong personalities. Uh, we both have facial hair. <laughs> hey, boy. Okay, let's go head over here. Their hair is going crazy sometimes. Why Barb not thick like Cardi B? I did the, uh, you put the latest drivers in mods and if you grab them, I haven't, no. Um, I guess I, did I already find this? I guess I found this one. I think it has an automatic updater. I should probably check. Ah, not everyone can tell. Oh, this is the guy we bought the uh, lantern from. This is the guy we bought the lantern from. We also bought the S stock from him, apparently. Uh, okay, let's see. Subscription. What do we got? No, dude, I even made all the jumps up there too. <laughs> Uh, Super Wario World. Thank you very much. I was just trying to get off the horse. There we go. Praise the jumping. A sacrificial twig. So if you have the sacrificial twig equipped, uh, when you die, it's like a ring of sacrifice. Uh, when you die, you won't lose anything. You die, you don't lose anything. Underrated GameCube game. We. Ooh. Did we do this? I don't know if I did this. Enter Ever Jail. Sure. Uh, thank you, Super Wario World. I don't know if I've done this. Aiden. Thief of fire. So one fucking chick throws the moon at me and this chick throws the sun at me. Or this guy throws the sun. He's got a flail. You actually do some pretty, pretty good damage.
They like that bleed. Aw, oh, you asshole. Jesus Christ. Oh, all out of juice, huh? Yeah, there we go. Good dancer. Flame of the Fell God. Cool. Fucking wreck. That bleed damage was nice. His flail was inadequate. Adamantium, yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, cool. This game has so much content. I feel like they did not settle for like when they do these NPC fights, they're a lot I feel like they're more interesting than normal. Because like they've done NPC fights in Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3, Bloodborne. I feel like they're more interesting in this game because it's like they went the extra mile to make those NPCs have something unique about them. So all the NPC fights I've seen have been of a higher... What is... People are throwing shit at me in here. They've all been more interesting. Am I going to do a mage playthrough? Oh, I'm, I would love to. Yeah, I would love to check out the magic. That sounds fantastic. I've seen Patty do a little bit of the magic. He was saying that uh, the magic... He couldn't find a magic seller for a long time. And he was saying that he was stuck with like the basic spells for a long time. Magic playthrough looks fun as hell. I don't know why these like fire camps. Okay, a lot of super cool spells. Uh, I did find the spell where you can summon the moon and throw the moon at people. It costs 70 intelligence. And I am simply too dumb for that spell, apparently. <laughs> you need 70 intelligence to do it. Yeah, dude, I'm never going to get 70 intelligence. Sky looks so cool. Not with that, yeah, not with that attitude. Oh. Uh. We found a poison swamp. Shocker. I like that the horse just doesn't care. Mooner magic. So we've kind of been in this area before, I think. We've kind of been here before. Vow of the Indomitable. Okay. Lucky Barb has unending patience to uh, conquer difficult boss fights. We've talked about this before on stream about what is the difference between patience and stubbornness. This was the village where we fought the totally not Capra Demon. Capra Demon. He even had his dogs. Totally wasn't Capra Demon. Hmm. If it helps, I was being a smartass. Ooh, sm and you know, I am so desperate for smithing stones. I am desperate for all kinds of smithing stones. I don't know what tier of smithing stone I need. 
for my weapons. Does anybody know? I think it's like tier three or something. It, well, you know what's funny is that I, when I, I so I watched a little, I watched Zeus playing playing this game, and he has the exact he he was having literally the exact same issue, <laughs> like the exact same issue. Like I can't find stones. Zeus, yeah, dude, Zeus, Zeus is a goddamn hero, dude. Yeah, he was on, he was like full spoilers chat. Tell me like, I want to know. He was like trying to find I know the funny thing is that nobody in chat really knew. Like nobody knew. Uh, you see this like upper ridge? This like big upper ridge area. You see anything here? Precious item ahead. Likely missed. Still no pickle. Time for gorgeous view. Uh, it must be a, it's a misty day outside. Don't think. Oh, don't think. Wish I like playing these types of games. I absolutely hate playing them, but enjoy watching. I mean, you know, I mean, that's fine. Some games are more of a spectator thing. It's totally fine. I get it. So I'm pretty sure we killed the guy here already. Yeah, I think we did. Bug snacks. I mean, that's pretty much all of Kaizo Mario's shit that people would like to watch, but not actually want to play themselves. Pretty much all of Kaizo Mario. Dude, that'll give you something special for Smithing Rune. You check it out. You see that path down there? If I jump from here, I'll die. Wonder how you get down there. Carefully go for it. Yeah, yeah, jump. But Barb, you've got the fall damage rune. Just put that on. <laughs> yeah, just use the no fall damage. I really enjoyed the uh, university area. That was cool. Oh, check it out. Hang on. There's something here. Guide and gatekeeper for those returning to the roots. So those are strange. They're kind of like weird waypoint things. Sword dance. Got a whole bunch of bats in here. All right. I would rather not fight 70 bats. Still know something incredible. Door ahead. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. What do we got? Every time I find something, I'm like, oh, shit. So maybe this is how you get all the way to that island tower. Maybe like this is how you get there. Roads and catacombs. There actually was a door ahead. Now, oh, great.
All right, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to change weapons. The reason being is that I don't think these things bleed. So if I can't make them bleed, then the claw is kind of, the claws are kind of pointless. What does that do? Hmm. Somewhere a door has opened. Uh, what level are these guys going to be at? How long are the game expecting you to be here? Uh, I don't think I'm like, I don't, I think for this area, I'm not super OP. It was actually a real one. It was actually a real one. <laughs> it was actually a real one. That's the first one that wasn't a goddamn liar. Found another rune arc. Is this going to be another secret path? Root resin. This was the door we opened. Is there item durability in this game? Not to my knowledge, no. All right, what do we got? Spirit caller. Who the fuck are you? Wait. Where the hell is the guy? Fucking witch is a hemwick. Bro. I was waiting for there to be another one. <laughs> I was like, where's the second one? Okay. There was a snail in here. I think we're not done here though. Cause this was all a secret path. This returns us to the entrance. How do you get out of the hell area? I don't know what the hell area is. Warm face. <laughs> Wormface is the greatest boss in all FromSoft history. Turn the console off to get out of the hell area. God damn it, dude. Slave Knight Gale, Midir the Dark Eater, Wormface. Bro, another wow, this this dungeon is full of hidden walls. Uh watchdog staff. That for casting spells. Which one is the master splinter? There's no way this is another Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, like every wall on this dungeon is fake. <laughs> They're all fake in this one. I like the magic, the magic arrows being fired out. That's cool. Always has been. How is Elden Ring been so far? Uh, Elden Ring has been absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. 
No shocker there. Thought it was going to be a mimic chest. Rhea Lucaria, Soldier's Ashes. Still no trap. I guess other people are waiting for one too. Hidden path ahead. You're full of shit. Hmm. You just found the anchor. Where did you, where did you find the anchor? I'm, I'm, I'm only, I'm curious. I'm honestly curious. Yeah, okay, I can't believe I missed that. Uh, I've been checking for mimics. <sighs> I'm seeing any. So is that it for this dungeon or is there more? We fought a boss in here. I kind of feel like that might be it. We also found the return too. Hmm. I kind of think that might be it. You like these smaller dungeons? I think that might be it. It had a lot of smithing stones in a dungeon that also had it. I'm not even sure what tier of smithing stone I need. So I have four level one, six level two. I have, this is what I need. I need smithing stone three, desperately. That is what I need. Dude, look at how many smithing stones five I have. Look at that. You see that? <laughs> It's just smithing stone three. I don't know where these are. I have no... That's what I need so bad. God. Bump you. Man. I thought there'd be something else. I thought there'd be something else here. Is there a way to convert smithing stones of one level into another? Uh, not to my knowledge yet. Shelbyville, thank you so much for the 1,000 bits. Thank you, Shelbyville. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you, the Archivist, for the 58 months. I really appreciate that, dude. Thank you so much. Uh, Mr. Bob Gray, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. I thought there might be a path to this island thing over here. Like, this, this thing or wherever it is. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not even sure where it was, but apparently not. Uh, apparently, we've already been here. Imagine getting smithing stones two through five in a rando. So, I guess let's keep going north here. Because we haven't really been over here, and let's see what we can find. I haven't found, not only haven't I, have I not found a place to buy smithing stones three or four, I haven't found any way to buy smithing stones, period. I have checked every vendor. I have checked every, like everywhere. I haven't found it yet. It's a big world, so it doesn't necessarily surprise me, but yeah, I haven't found it yet. Cuckoo's Everjail, sure. Uh, Snow X, thank you for the 31 months. Thank you, Snow X. Where's my claws? All right, claws ready. Bowls carrying night. Oh my god, dude. How? I don't even know what that was, dude. <laughs> Bro, he just yelled at me and knocked me down. Ah! 
It's got bad breath. Hey. Great Blade Phalanx. So it looks like some of these, uh, some of these fights you uh, unlock additional, additional spells and stuff too. Okay. Uh, thank you, Snowix. Thank you, Mr. Bob. Great. Appreciate it. I wonder if like, if you finish all the Ever Jails, do you, uh, do you get something for that? I wonder. Oh, was he s what? I thought it was a friendly NPC. I thought that was going to be a friendly NPC. Nope. Don't do that. Uh, flame cleanse me. Nope. That's not the right button. This is how you cleanse. No more poison, please. Thank you. Uh, I got COVID. Should have taken my shots. Well, it's a good thing I got the ivermectin to cure me right up. No problem. You like my salsa bowl hat? got rabies rabies is a pretty scary disease neil young intensifies those were bat sirens were they trying to was was the goal there to lure me to my death was that the goal yeah rabies is uh very serious i think one of the most i think rabies is really fascinating uh because if i'm not mistaken doesn't so rabies creates an aversion to water because of the parasite in your brain, correct? Uh, and it makes you averse to water. I think that's fascinating how it like affects your brain's chemistry and like how your brain works and shit. No, I didn't, I didn't say it's like, oh man, that's so cool. I hope that happens to me. I'm simply saying, man, that's pretty fucking cool. Minus five health in Crusader Kings. It's plus 10% damage in Darkest Dungeon, I believe. Or 15%? I can't remember. It's minus some accuracy, though. You're not cool unless you get rabies. Uh, Teutonius, thank you for the 46 months. Thank you, Teutonius. That's some Resident Evil 4 shit. I think nature and science are just fascinating. It's a virus. Barb sold out the big rabies. Teutonius, thanks so much. Grass Pepper, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. The four Belfries. Use it up. No! No! This takes you somewhere. No, dude. This one too. This one too. It's 
Do these all these take you somewhere? When did Wolverine get a sweet new outfit? What's this? The fuck is this? Imbued sword key? The hell is that? Unseals Sendigate, but disappears upon use. So it's like the other stone keys, but it's different because this one is a, is for a gate then, I guess. So there are, so is there two different kinds of these keys? Is that, is that what I'm supposed to take this for? There's two different kinds of these keys. One is for doors and one is for these gates, I guess. Well, I don't know which one to do then, man. <laughs> what does this one say? Ah, uh, don't you dare. Night night sky unceasing. Which one do I do? This one? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I wonder where my glove will go. What does this one say? Key ahead. Elden Ring. Oh, Elden Ring. Crumbling lands. All right, let's just do this one. Use this one. So now we need to find another one of these keys. All right, where is this going to take me? That's not how a key works. Yeah, right? <laughs> it all disappears upon use. <laughs> Where the, where the fuck am I? <laughs> Bro! <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, okay, that's the way down. Okay, how hilariously under leveled am I for this area? Oh, 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 holy shit. Uh barely scratched him. Where actually uh where does this put me? So, see, here's the thing. If I could just... This is why the weapon situation is getting worse and worse. If I could just upgrade my weapon, this probably wouldn't be so bad. Like, this probably... I could probably do this. But I don't know where these fucking materials are. Like, I could probably do this. I lost 30,000 souls. Bullshit. We're going right back. I know, I know. I mean, I'm at, I'm at plus eight. What about armor? I have literally the heaviest armor I have on right now. All of the heaviest armor I currently have, I'm wearing. Look at all the people who died right here. Okay, I don't see where to go. Is 
Is there anywhere to go? Oh, this way. Pearl Drake Talisman. Need the glider. <laughs> okay, now I probably lost 30,000 souls. Is there is there an equivalent of a homeward bone in this game? Boost, uh, wait, where is it? Pearl, what was it? Pearl Gate Talisman, what was it? Uh, boost non-physical damage negation. Well, if we're ever fighting a fucking, uh, if we're ever fighting a thing, the torch from the merchant takes you back to your last bonfire. The torch? I don't know if I have that item. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try going here again because I feel like there's another way to go. Can I? Oh, you know what? That's actually not a bad idea. Hang on. Let's equip one of the will be lost on pl death in place of runes. That's a smart idea. That's a good idea. Uh, Doc Softlock, thank you for the 15 months. Egro, thank you for 13 months. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. Yeah, I just I it's I'm not seeing if there's a place to go here. What I was thinking is that what if this area is kind of like the Demon Bell area? in Sekiro. You know what I'm saying? Like, like there's nothing else to do here, you know? You know what this guy is? I mean, aside from the guy murdering me. It really looks like there's nowhere else to go. It actually does look like there's nowhere else to go. This guy looks like the giant soldier we saw. Uh, the giant guy that we fought that I raged against. Hey, nice. So, hey, I got my 30s. I got them back. I got them back. <laughs> nice. Got them back. Fuck yeah, dude. Uh, we fought a guy that he was a giant version of that guy. It was a boss. He was in the underground. <sighs> okay. I mean, it seemed like there wasn't really m m anywhere to go. It seemed like there wasn't anywhere to go. Try another belt. Try another one of these things. Dude, I can't because I need more keys. I don't have the stone shard keys for that. So I can't do that. And you look, maybe you're supposed to kill those two. Maybe you get the key if you kill them. Oh, uh, like you kill them, you get the key, and then you kill some more guys and you get the key. If that's the case, I mean, I could sit here and fucking kill those guys and try it, but uh, for one thing, those guys are pretty fucking tough. And my damage is shit. So that would be pretty tough to accomplish. I'm almost positive you can't summon the horse in there. Almost positive. Well, we found another we found another cool area way off way off here. Way off here. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows when? Is my helmet getting full? I think I just landed on that tree. Uh Tobin, thank you very much. Thank you, Tobin, for the twelve months. Here's a tip, guys. Do not fuck with the lobsters. Don't fuck with them. 
Ain't worth it. Try take my word for it. Uh, isn't, is that what I needed? Smithing stone three. That is what I need. I, I need more of those. Maybe, so maybe this is the right area for that. Oh, God. Maybe we're in the right, like, vicinity. Every time in this game, you think you've met the biggest asshole in the game. Trust me, you haven't met the biggest asshole in the game. <laughs> Every time you think you've met the biggest asshole in the game, you're, you haven't. Uh, Asriel, thank you for the three months. Expensive box, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Goof Troops, thank you for the 12 months. Thank you, Goof Troops. Wish you guys. Hope you guys are having a good weekend. And thank you very much. My dingling. My dingling. Peepo dingling. Have you saved Zelda yet? Uh... I like that enemies everywhere. Like you can fight enemies everywhere and fighting actually has like, if you can do a fight easily, it has a benefit because you can restore your Estus everywhere by killing enemies. I feel like that extends the amount of time you can do doing things like uh, exploring, which I feel like is a smart design choice. Uh, I got knocked off my horsey. Okay, well, this is really not going well, is it? You got fucking Magic Knight over here and this fucking Spear guy. So the last time we fought one of these guys, uh, we fought this thing. I got a weapon from it. There was a weapon in the back of it. So many guys. Get 
get him. He's only a tarnish. Dude, my guy, my guy is not playing Elden Ring. My guy is playing Sifu. Look at all these bodies. <laughs> okay, this world is so interesting. Okay, so we see the chest. Ice strike. We want if we want to open the chest, we got to kill these guys. So can I open it now or do I have to kill the other one too? Okay, it looks like you only have to kill one. You don't have to kill both. They just need to stop moving. Carrion Knight's sword. So we got a new sword. So it looks like these things are weapon drops. Okay, this is uh intelligence. Check it out. Carrion Grandeur. Transform blade into a magical greatsword and swing it down. Bro, it can be charged to increase his power up by two levels. Needs 18 intelligence. That's two weapons I've found that require intelligence. Two skills. So like this one and then the, the flail also requires the intelligence. Maybe I should spend some levels on intelligence. I'm too stupid. You're looking for those weapons? What intelligence? It's like a huge convoy of enemies. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, we're going this way. What build are you are you trying? You're doing a Dex intelligence build. Uh, I've been doing mostly Dex. Uh, I started off with I started off the Wretch class, so I was level one. For a while, I was using the, the obviously the club I started with. Then I went to a spear. Then I went to a flail. Then I went to the Wolverine claws, which I like the Wolverine claws. And I've also got a black dagger, this black knife uh, that I got from killing an assassin dude. So I'm like mostly dex. Uh, some weapons require, it seems like there's a lot of weapons that require some faith. Whoa, well, that was fortuitous. Kind of seems like there's a lot of faith weapons in the game. Oh boy. Possibly my strategy here was not the best. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe my strat wasn't the best. I just saw that guy up top shooting shit at me and I was like, we'll run up there first. Maybe that wasn't the best strategy there. Uh Where? Bro, I'm here again. Man. I really, really, really want to explore that area, dude. That area, that Belfry area gave me some very strong uh, Ring City vibes with the tornado. Some very strong Ring City vibes to me. Uh, I haven't, you know, I, 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 I've been playing Dark Souls for a while. You know what kind of killed, you know what's kind of weird for me is that I never really care or pay attention to my souls because of Dark Souls randomizer. Like I never pay attention. I'm aware I have like 35,000 souls or whatever, but I just, I never pay attention to it. It'll work out. Or if it doesn't, I don't know. <laughs> if I lose those souls, I'm not like, ah, my souls. Like it's like, eh, I'll be fine. Too much randomizer. Yeah, in Dark Souls randomizer, you'll walk around 
and like manis will spawn a manis will spawn and fall into a cliff and you'll suddenly get 30,000 souls i was like oh i guess i just got 30,000 souls <laughs> like that'll happen you know you shouldn't be like me you're right to care about your souls you shouldn't be like me you're absolutely right to care about your souls You should also realize that if you lose your souls, it's not the end of the world. You'll get more. Trust me. Losing 350,000 souls in Seath's library on your first playthrough. How the hell did you manage that on your first playthrough? What the fuck were you doing? Yeah, when you're new to the game, it feels really bad. I, I fully understand that. It's like, Mom, I could have leveled. No. I fully understand that. Who the fuck are you? There's no way. So this this wouldn't be a new. You don't think this would be like a new weapon here, right? Yeah. Okay. It's it's open. Okay, we're gonna have to be a little bit smarter this time. <laughs> That's Elden Ring. So that is the spirit of Elden Ring. Have you found anybody that buys stuff? Uh, there's a lot of places that say they are they you can sell. I feel like a lot of it is selling another rune arc. Well, you know what? Let's do it. I have the great rune equipped. Do it. Why not? I'm really scared to open this chest because I'm afraid it's going to send me somewhere. Treasure chest ahead. I'm afraid it's going to send me somewhere. does the rune last the great rune power up lasts like a really long time i don't know how long but it definitely lasts a really long time Honestly, I just now figured out how to get the great rune equipped because we figured out how to get to this tower over here. That's what allowed me to power up the rune and figure out the great rune thing. We just figured it out. I don't know the best time. Ooh, new Warhammer. I don't know like when the best time to use it is. I don't know. I'm, I'm just using it whenever, I guess. Oh, I, th I was hoping it would go off the cliff. Am I 
guess he kind of did. I feel like one of these treasure chests is going to send me somewhere. Smithing stone for... Alabaneric blood clot. I'm assuming that's another crafting material. What I'm going to assume there. Ah, whatever. You blood clots. You don't want to. You don't want a chunk of blood. Have I figured out the puzzle walls? No. And if you spoil something for me, I'll be very, very miffed. I'll be very upset. Cucko glintstone. Cucko glintstone. A lot of cucko glintstone. Is that for upgrading certain weapons? Came back for revenge. Bro, 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 bro. God damn it, dude. What does this game have against you ever healing? Thank you. God, what a piece of shit. Cucko Knight Greaves. Uh, so mine are 10.8 physical. Uh, this banished knight stuff I have seems to be the heaviest armor I can wear at the moment. Back up to third. I'm at. I'm, what are you talking about? I'm up to thirty-eight thousand souls. <laughs> so, I feel like me traveling. I feel like I'm gonna bother you guys with the amount of souls I'm traveling around with. Oh, dude, we, we needed one of these pretty bad. Okay. Oh, were we already here? We've already been here before? Where are we? Oh, I guess we've, uh, I guess we've been to this one. So we just kind of did a big circle around the four belfries. We just kind of did a big circle around it. Uh, the four belfries are where, uh, let's see. Okay. Uh, all right. I'm going to travel quickly back here. Uh, no, we're not going to travel back. Let's just level up, I guess. Getting so easy, so I don't understand why you don't really look at it. All right, uh, we can level up something else. I guess let's go. Ah, uh, you know, let's start some. Does this what actually raises your FP? Mind. Mind gives you more FP. More FP would be pretty nice. Intelligence is required. Let's grab some intelligence. Why not? We'll grab some intelligence. Yeah, intelligence will work for the mind flail and the sword. We're going to need the mind flail if we're going to be able to fight the mind goblin. <laughs> All right, I'm going to head towards the three. I want to see if I can get over there. I really like the mind goblin joke. Ah, <sighs> we need more smithing stones three. We need more of those. We need more of those stones, man. Have I gotten to the magic island with no bridge yet? I don't remember. Maybe? No. No, I haven't. Yeah. 
Uh, oh, no. Yeah, Dragon Temple. Yeah, we figured out Dragon Temple. That one we figured out. Fuck. Damn it. What does this say? Seek three wise beasts. You must solve the puzzle to enter. When it says seek three wise beasts. I'm not looking. I don't want the answer. I'm, I'm like very pointedly avoiding looking at chat. Do we think I don't if you know, I don't want to know. Do we think that the moose, the deer moose God we killed was one of the divine beasts? You can you, you we're, we're speculating. I don't want to know if you know, but do you think that the deer moose is one of those? I feel like that's that seems that seemed like a divine beast or that seemed like a beast that we wanted to kill, right? That sounds reasonable to me. So if that's the case, where the hell will we find more of that, right? If that if that was true, how would we find more of those? That I don't know. I Means you have to take a detour to Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Yeah. I guess let's keep going this way. I guess we're going to keep going this way. I thought it was a cave, not gonna lie. So I feel like something that's really critical in this game is finding these caves that give you lots of the smithing stones. If you don't find the, the caves, it's gonna be difficult. Like you need to find these caves. Have you learned any of the wise beast moves? Uh, yes. Yes, I have. Uh, a number of the moves I have right now. So apparently, did I already find this? Uh, hang on. So I've got bestial. So I've got this heal. I also have this. Check it out. I can throw rocks. I haven't tried the throw rocks move, but I've got that. I can poison. I can heal. So I have some beast moves, but... I guess let's keep going forward here. I don't know if we went to the end of this. Pocket sand, yep. I love when people have advice and their advice is like, just find it, Lamau like wow so helpful <laughs> bro just find it lamau subscription kill my horsey Uh, Taxman Barnes. Thank you for the five months. Thank you, Taxman. All right, we're going to... I'm going to go up this river the entire way. I want to see where this goes. Yeah, I think I have that sword now, too, with the, the glowy glows. I think I've got that sword, too. Freddy Krueger in a bowl of grapes. <laughs> Those knights are pretty pimped out. Okay. Possibly a good thing I went here. Check it out. We got another another golden seed. A little choppy frame right there. 
Smithing stone five. Wow. Hmm? Oh shit, it's Cuphead. Oh, can I, uh, let's go to my flasks. I may be able to upgrade my flasks. Hang on. Oh, I need, wow, I need four. <laughs> I need four fucking flasks. Or four seeds. All right, so this is a new area. We've never been here before. Let's go on up. Looks like this might be some kind of like ruin excavation mine or something. Who knows, right? Taking the Grail Knight theme a little too literally. <laughs> this game is so goddamn good, dude. It really is. You guys know I'm 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 You guys know I'm picky and you know you know me. This game really is so fucking good. Oh, I'm addicted. No shit. Okay, this is looking promising for smithing stones. I am not sure if these guys bleed. I'm not sure if these guys bleed. It might be time to go to the flail. You know, honestly, I gotta say, having multiple kinds of weapons for multiple kinds of damage has actually been quite helpful. Like having the flail and the claws and the dagger, like it actually has been quite good. The only dumb part about that is that I've spread my damage out. But it has been good. Vulgar Militia Saw. Vulgar Militia Shotel? Bro, what are these weapons? We got a saw? Damn, dude. It's like a halberd style. That's neat. And we have a sickle. Which is like another kind. That's cool. Neat. Seems like they're pretty similar weapons. Uh, they both scale with dex. The saw causes bleed. That's kind of cool. They both scale with dex. This one is more of a... Uh, like slightly different weapons. Bro, this is... Check out this one. This is like a, a staff. Whoa, look at this weapon. It's like a big fucking club. <laughs> now, that's a big beaten stick, dude. That is a big, big beaten stick. Uh, we also got the war pick, which is cool. That's neat. Like a big hammer. Uh, all right, let's go back to my flail. Where's my flail? Bring me my flail. Frida. Okay, more smithing stones. So this area up this up this river seems like it's pretty good for smithing stones. That's good. The uh, the jump attack, you just jump and press attack. So you can jump and press R1 or you can jump and press R2. Jumping R2 seems really good to me because it looks like it does a lot of stagger damage. So it seems good. But um, I try to work it in when I can. Seems good. Still no item. Try backstepping. Okay, we're going up in this ruin. That's cool. Uh, there was an item there. We're going way up. We're going way, way up, apparently. <laughs> uh, strong foe ahead. Hmm? 
What controller am I using? Uh, I am playing with an Xbox One controller. Or Xbox, whatever. Xbox controller. You rebind sprint to be able to sprint and move your camera, or do you hold your controller different? I hold my controller differently. Uh, if you want to see how I hold my controller, I hold it like this. So this is how I hold it at, like, at all times. That means I can run, attack, and move the camera freely. I've been doing it like for a long time. It just it is what it is. I know that that might be freakish for some of you, but that's how it be. What's this mist? Oh, you're alive. A whole lot of upgrade materials. Lightning grease. Uh, oh, you want to poison me? Oh, so sorry. That doesn't that doesn't work on me, motherfucker. Boom, I'm healed. Nice try. Little chop right there. Bro, fuck you. <laughs> what the fuck? Grace ahead. Ruin strewn precipice. So man, this like excavation area. Wow, this is so cool. We're like inside this this mountain ruin area. And there's like all these ruins exist within there. We missed. Okay, let's go back to that previous elevator. We missed something by jumping off. Let's go. Let's go check that out. A little choppy. That's okay. Man. This is a game that makes so many other games look like dog shit. <laughs> this is a game that like the pri it seems like the primary purpose of this game was to make other games look like dog shit. Like, why would I ever waste my time ever playing that game? Oy! Oh, you know what? I, f I forgot I had a jump. I should probably remember I can jump in this game. Here? I don't see anything else. I guess that was, that was it. Okay, that was it. Seems like a lot of work for one item, but okay. All right, back up. Name names. Just just flexing on everybody else. Is this my new favorite Souls-like? I mean, I don't think Dark Souls 1 and Dark Souls 3 and Bloodborne and Sekiro. I don't think these games are now like obsolete. Nor do I think games like Breath of the Wild or, or Skyrim. Um, I don't think those, I wouldn't say those games are obsolete either. What I would say is that I hope future I, I hope and I'm I'm positive that future devs are taking furious notes. And I feel like that this game has risen has raised the bar. This game has really raised the bar. The bar has been fucking raised to an, a ludicrous amount. Would I recommend this as a first Souls type game? Well, it's not really a Souls game because it's not, you know, it's not Dark Souls 1, 2, or 3. What I would say about this game is that if you play this game Souls veteran or not, you're going to get your ass eaten. 
Yeah, this game is going to eat your ass. It's hard. This is a hard, hard game. Literal, like, god players have gotten their ass eaten. And that, and that is part of the fun. That is part of the fun and the experience. Out of here, bats. It's your first Souls game and you're loving it? Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad to hear that. Try right. Try right. Okay, so it looks like there's a path over there. But there's also a path over here. Well, what the... And there's a path down here! Fucking hey, God damn it, there's so many fucking paths. <laughs> Precious item. All right, let's go down first, I guess. Fucking A. Down, right, up. I don't know. Let's go this way. I don't know if I found a purpose for cracked crystals yet. With all these somber smithing stones, um, we can probably upgrade the knife again. Not that the knife, the knife is that great. You must smoke the crack. <laughs> Why is there a plate on my head? Uh, excuse me. It's a fucking bowl. Thank you. Uh, my character is, uh, you probably heard it. My character is from Boletaria. Come on, that was pretty good. That was a good one. Boletaria. You're not going to give me that one? I deserve a little bit. Give me something. <laughs> I would have went with Bola Bolarus. Boletaria is from Demon Souls. Come on. <laughs> from Boland. More golden runes. Oh, there's an item up there. You know what? I got something for you. Rocks. Rocks. Bits. Rocks. Rocks. <laughs> we will, we will rock you. Go ahead and cure the poison. Uh, a real life Italian, thanks to 100 bits. Thank you very much. No lover head, therefore, time for pickle. Time for blood stain. It's like people are finding these little like statue things and they're like sitting on them and leaving messages of like try butthole <laughs> because of course uh pyro pove thank you for the 19 months thank you very much may as well heal 
Oh, that guy, that guy's got a big fucking sword. Where do you get that sword? I haven't even seen that sword. Have I left a message? I don't know. I haven't. Okay, so we know that there was an item over here, right? We saw it. Let's go check it out. Uh, golden room. There are gold, yeah. Runes are souls, yeah. So, this area has a crap load of upgrade material, an absolute crap load of it. I like the singing bats. They're cool. Okay, something really, really mean is over there. Something really fucking mean is over there. Is it like two of these things? Wow, I really don't. This bat is fucked. Man, that there, this bat. So there's two different kinds of bats now. There's the original bat, which is pretty easy. There's the singing bat, which is a little bit harder. And then there's like the magic bat, which is like, oh my God, fuck the magic bat, dude. The magic bat is rough. Okay. Uh, all right. I guess we're going up some more. Uh, I need more intelligence for the family flail. Don't have enough INT for that. Okay, we found, cool. We found another, uh, another grace. Fuck the family, fuck the magic bat, a new children's novel. I think we can, uh, yeah, we can level up again. Uh, I almost want some more mine. I almost want some more mine. Let's get a little bit smarter. Let's get a little bit smarter. Was this the intelligence I needed for this sword? Let's get a little bit smarter here, right? No, we need 18 intelligence for that one. We're still too dumb. Yeah. Uh, Ty Beaudry, thank you for the 43 months. Oh boy, that's a big fucking door too. I don't know what's in here, man. <laughs> okay, well, let's start a bet. I have no idea what's in here. Start prediction. First try. Yes or no? First try. I do not know what's in here. No idea. What do you think? Have you tried the Uchi Katana? I could, I could try it. I would have to level it up. I would have to level it up. No idea what's in here. Does this feel as intricately linked together as Dark Souls? Well, 
Dark Souls, there's still like a very clear path. Like you still, this game is a lot less linear than Dark Souls. And Dark Souls isn't a super linear game, right? Like Dark Souls, Dark Souls 1. Like, but you still have these very decided goals. This game, you do have those basic goals, I guess, of like go to the tree and defeat these people and defeat this guy. But there's just so much to do and so many areas to go and explore that it's just so much more open. It's a more open experience than something like Dark Souls 1. Dark Souls 1 is already pretty open and you can go wherever you want and do whatever you want. But this is like that times a thousand. Very different. So. Okay. Subscription. Let's see what we got. What's in here? Magma Worm Makar. Come here, you fucking wind waker bitch. Thank you, honey. God, that is such bullshit. Dude, I was rolling too. It didn't matter. Come on, man. Hey, magma worm scale sword. Nice, did it. Up. Oh. Draw. Oh, we got another dragon heart too. Oh fuck! All right, where is the sword? Let's take a look. Magma guillotine. It requires 24 strength. Damn, dude. Ooh. Whoa, dude. <laughs> Seems like it levels up mostly with strength, but it has some of the other damage. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I needed 16. Bro! I can wield the family head since when? 
subscription. <laughs> Check it out. <laughs> Bro. I can win since, since when? Is it the great rune that lets me equip it? Is that why I can wield that? Neat. I wonder how much damage those do. Okay, well, let's keep going forward. Uh, Don Dan Don Daniel, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Really appreciate that. Nanny Skexis, thank you for the seven months. Thank you, Nanny Skexis. Praise the friend. Dragon ahead. Oh, this is where we... Okay, we just came out from there. No chest. Uh, I, I I went the wrong way out. I don't remember which way I came in. Guess let's grab more intelligence. Family heads, yay. I wonder how much damage that does. <laughs> what, a, what a fucking cool visual place. Oh, there was another thing in here. Huh? Yeah, we're going to pay the believers. Oh, can I wield the intelligence sword now? Oh, I can. Okay, so we got this sword too. Pretty basic. Bro! That's the carrion grandeur. <laughs> Neat. Another elevator. I wish that boss had been a little bit like Shadow of the Colossus. I mean, Dark Souls and Shadow of the Colossus, it's like, man, I really wish, I really wish Super Mario World was more like fucking battle tanks. Like, they're totally different. Nothing alike. You're beelining for that sword when you play. Atlas Plateau. Where where am I? Huh. So we found another way up. Was this was this what the guy was telling me about there being like another path, like a coward's path up? Was that the coward's path we just found? Is that what that was, maybe? So that was like the other way to get up here, I guess. That was the other way to get up here, I guess. Okay, so we found both ways. So the other way to go up here is to go through the ruin strewn precipice and the the valley which we just went through. The other way is to collect the two elevators. So there's two ways up to the plateau. You can go up through here through the uh, ravine which we just went through and you got to fight the boss or you can get the two pieces of the elevator and take the grand lift of Dectus up. But you can go up either way to the plateau. So we found now we found both ways to get up here. Okay, that's cool. Gotcha. Understood. We have six of these smithing stones now for the three. Might be able to upgrade a weapon again. Okay. We're gonna go here. Because I, I think that I think that's a map. I think. I didn't even press A. Just want this item, whatever it is. Flurger Bloom. <laughs> a Fulger Boom. Where Filgor? Mod Filgor now. Fire Blonger. Thing longer. Uh, 
Uh, Golden Sneak. Thank you for the seven months. Thank you, Golden Sneak. Phil Gore Band. Uh, thank you, Golden Sneak. Well, let me, uh, let's go ahead and pay the people before people are like, Hey, borrow my channel points. What the heck? Uh, first try, the answer was yes. Believers getting a nice payday there. Uh, there you go, Believers. Uh, just Kit, thank you for the 29 months. Thank you, Just Kit. I hope everything is going well with you, too. Should have believed in me. Are you, do you guys, did you guys disbelieve in me? Because when you watch people play this game, nobody ever first tries anything. <laughs> is that why? Like, man, nobody ever first tries shit. Everybody dies over and over. Did I, did I find this one? Apparently I never found this one. Subscription. Uh, King Kiryu, thank you for the 22 months. Thank you very much. Yes, Law. Well, what you guys didn't realize is that when you're watching a streamer of this caliber is that I'm better than your average gamer. <laughs> God, gamer. Krungo, leave. <laughs> Uh, Perry Necessary. Thank you for the, uh, six months. Thank you, Perry Necessary. Appreciate that. King Kiryu, thank you very much. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Just here for the item. Ah, so these things are maps, I think. Uh, what's up, dude? Ah, look who we have here. How delightful to meet a familiar face. Even after departing the round table, I've been doing some learning of my own since then and will happily pass it along to you. He's got some new uh, spells. Catch flames, spark flames from hand. Uh, increased magic damage negation. This is all cool. These are all like miracles and stuff. I'm yet to find the noble gold mask. I suppose he'll be closer to the path ahead. Might be perilous. Since departing the round table hold, I've come to understand in my solitude how little it is I true. May the golden order. Oh, uh, how's the crafting system? All right, so we have the map finally of this area. Thank God for that. Um, So you can craft a whole bunch of different stuff. I haven't crafted much. I haven't crafted much. Yeah. Uses FP to continually hear allies. Uses FP to scatter sparks in a wide area. I haven't crafted it. Shrink it seems like a lot of consumables. Paid for in blood. The way it seems to me is that how the what they what they've done is that they've eliminated a lot of shops. Like a lot of vendors in the game that sell random things. And now you craft a lot of these things yourself. And that's what this seems like they've done. And dude, for all I know, we don't know enough about the game. For all I know, this crafting shit is insanely broken. Like, you know, you make the freeze in Greece, you use that on a boss, they take additional damage and like you're done. For all I know, it's like the most insanely OP thing ever. I honestly have no idea. So. Uh, Ephemeral, thank you for the three months. Thank you very much. Uh, Eternal, thank you for nine months. Danny Beans, thank you for the 12 months. Thank you very much. Probably. All right, so we got a new map of the Atlas Plateau here. It looks like there is another map uh, right here in the volcano area. Another map over there. Uh, as for where we're going next... Beats me.
Um, let's go. Let's go double back because there was kind of like uh, at this previous thing. Let's go double back here. Uh, is there a way to remove all your things, all your markers? Is there a way to do that? I like how you think you have... I really like how you think you have to tell me to explore the game. What the fuck do you think I've been doing this entire time? <laughs> what do you fucking think I've been doing? Dude, if anything, if anything in this game, I have explored to a fault. Because as soon as I got into the game, I was like, oh, I just went like, wee, and I've been exploring... And, like, I fucking went all over the place seeing all different kinds of shit. If anything, it actually hurt me. Because I got, like, way where I wasn't supposed to be finding shit that I was not ready for. So, if anything, exploring... I've actually explored too much. Remind you of Dark Souls 2. Let's go back to my uh, claws. Oh. The hell are you shooting at? If you're thirsty, drink water. Uh, incorrect. I will be drinking coffee. Thank you very much. Upgrade new intelligence weapons. Well, I don't have enough intelligence right now. I think I can only wield it by using the great rune. So it seems like kind of a bad idea to over invest in those for now. Trolls Golden Sword. What is the Trolls Golden Sword? Damn, that's a cool sword. Look at this. I like it. Neat. Seems uh very slow. This is like a uh, claymore. Colossal Sword. Trolls roar. Look into this and let on intense roar, generating a powerful shock wave. So this this weapon art. <laughs> so stupid. That's so stupid. If anything, if I were to use a weapon, I really like that Drake sword that creates like lava on the ground and shit. That one seems dope as hell. Oops. Great shield talisman. Okay, I got a new talisman. Boost guarding ability. Okay, that's cool. Um, so my current talismans are greatly raises maximum stamina, greatly raises maximum equip load, greatly boosts physical damage negation is my are my current talismans. Uh, dope antelope. Thank you for the six months. Thank you, dope antelope. Oh, apparently I missed this. Oh, dude, I think that's another, uh, that's another flask, I think, because we only needed one more, right? I think we can make, uh, have another flask. How many talismans can you get? Uh, 
I well right now we can have three. I don't know if that we can get more. I don't know if we can get more than that, but right now we've got three. So we have 12 Crimson Tears. Lux Ruins. Yeah, there's been some frame dips for sure. I think this area, the plateau in general, is a little bit worse for frame dips than other areas. Is the game stuttering like crazy? It might be. First of all, it had a plateau problem too. I think it's the rain. It might be. So wait. There's gotta be something else here, right? Why would they name it? Why would they give this place a name of Lux Ruins if you can't do anything here? There's gotta be something else here, right? Ruins look all the same. Uh. I think this game has a ton of variety. I think that there are some dank, wet caves that kind of look similar, but I think that's just like the theme in the game. It's like the theme of the game. Like, what do, what do you expect? They have fixed it for frame drops, but I would not risk it. Yeah, I'm not going to risk anything right now either. It's mostly fine. The game's been mostly fine for me. So it really seems weird that there's this Lux Ruins, right? But I can't figure out how to get up into them. So there's like another tier of, of level here, but I don't know how to get up there. Uh, is there a way up maybe this way? No secret passage ahead. Oh, he wasn't wrong. Okay, let's go around the right side. You should play Shadows Die twice. Much better game cooler setting and more more settings mechanics what that that's that has to be some kind of really weird troll attempt <laughs> what the hell does that even mean uh sekiro is absolutely an incredible game though absolutely an incredible game love sekiro More like Sekiro. I fucking I adore Sekiro. Uh, Arturo, thank you for the eleven months. Thank you, Arturo. Okay, so this is how we get over here. I've played Sekiro like a million times. I've done uh, all bosses, all memories, all beads, no, deathless without any revives. I've played played a good amount of Sekiro. Oh, I think I was here actually. Was I here? Okay, yeah, we were definitely here. <laughs> I'm like, what is this mystery? What's in here? It's like, oh, I've been here. Okay, so. Elden Ring versus Tui. Uh, it's had some stutters. Yes, we've had some stutters and some issues, but uh, for the most part, the game has run very, very well. All right, uh, let's fast travel here to the outer wall battleground. Let's go that way. It's an open. Yeah, it's, this game is an open world souls like sort of. Yeah, it's pretty much what this game is. 
So I feel like this direction is progress. I feel like this is the way we're supposed to go. I'm playing on PC. Hang on. Is it stuttering that bad right now? It is kind of it is kind of stuttering a little bad, isn't it? Uh, is there anything I can do with my settings maybe to make it stutter not quite as bad? Well, hello, sir. Hello. Maybe like a little better. If you don't spin that fast, it's fine. So I'm not sure if this is how it works, but in this game, when you see these like, see a little smegum coming off of this, is that like telling me vaguely where to go? It's still just as bad. Like in that direction, sort of go that way. The rain is what's doing it right now. It's smooth on my end. Smooth on my end. Here. When I turn the camera sharply, I'd restart the PC. Then again, I don't live stream. Yeah, I'm not going to restart. Cap at 60 FPS. More smithing stones. I think I found another grace over here. Ooh, merchant. You said the 1080 borderless and set everything to high. Deactivate and reactivate your capture card in OBS. That's that's not going to help, but thank you. What do you sell? Rune arcs, uh, golden sunflower, uh, centuries torch. So they actually, you know, what's funny is that there actually is a torch attack. Like you push the torch into an enemy and you can maybe set them on fire with like a burn ability or something. That's pretty cool. I can sell stuff if I want. Wow. If you look at that, I have 24,000 souls right there. That's that's 24,000 souls. This is uh, that's a lot of souls, man. I've got a ton of souls. Okay. Man. All right, let's just keep going forward. Maybe we'll get inside and there will be less rain and effects. We'll get inside at some point. That's a big skull. Well, they've said they know about it, and they say they're going to do something about it, right? Ow. Are you still having connections to the internet? No, this has this has nothing to do with my internet. This has to do with the game's performance. This is the game, and, and honestly, there's been a lot of... I'm not, I'm not the only one. There are people with more powerful rigs than me 
who are not even streaming it who are having issues. So I think it might just be the game and like my setup or something. My bowl is going to fill with rainwater. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, the rain is probably having an effect for sure. Runs perfect on your crappy PS4. Oh, you hurt me. You hurt a lot. It's fine. Ah, no worries. Yeah. I just, I, you know, obviously I want my stream to look as good as possible for as long, you know, for the entirety of the stream. What do we got here? Here. Light. Oh, light. Why is it always jumping? Are they trying to convince me to jump down this fucking cliff? Do it. What about that way? For science? Great. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I wonder how many deaths have been caused by messages. I wonder how many deaths have been caused by fucking messages. Probably a lot. Hmm, so I'm not sure where we're going. I didn't, oh, that's why I need, I need the immunity talisman on. Seems like it's a lot smoother now that it's not raining, actually, doesn't it? I don't know if that's just me. Actually seems a lot smoother. We added rain to our game. The rain makes the game run considerably worse. Enjoy. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Uh, okay, so I don't think I've been here. Bro, God, these guys are such douchebags. Oh my God, it's the fucking dude. We, we made these giant machines to be giant douche. Get out of here, douche. Goddamn douchebags. Is there anything that screams George R. R. Martin in this game? I saw a tweet today that said George R. R. Martin faxed one a piece of paper with one word on it to the, to the FromSoft. And it just said tree. <laughs> All the company's fault. 